The Supra's track system has some distinct differences from that of the Camry and the Avalon. On 93 through 96 model year Supras, the track actuator is separate from the ABS actuator. An engine torque is controlled by a separate sub-throttle valve and actuator located ahead of the main throttle valve to restrict intake air volume. The sub-throttle actuator consists of a step motor located between the main throttle valve and air cleaner and is used to control the position of the sub-throttle valve based on commands from the track ECU. A sub-throttle position sensor is also used to provide a sub-throttle position signal to the ECM, which then transfers this signal to the track ECU. The track pump is used to generate brake fluid pressure when needed to apply the rear brakes during track system operation. The track brake actuator consists of a master cylinder cut solenoid valve and a reservoir cut solenoid valve. The master cylinder cut solenoid valve controls the hydraulic circuit between the master cylinder and the rear brake assemblies. During normal operation, when the track system is not activated, the track actuator valves are off and the brake system works normally. When traction control is activated, the track actuator works in conjunction with the ABS actuator to increase, hold, or reduce hydraulic pressure to the rear brake assemblies. During pressure increase mode, the master cylinder cut solenoid valve is activated to open port A to C and fluid pressure generated by the track pump flows through to increase pressure to the rear brake assemblies. The reservoir cut solenoid is activated simultaneously to allow fluid to return to the master cylinder reservoir from the ABS actuator reservoir. During pressure holding mode, the ABS actuator solenoids move to the hold position blocking track pump pressure to the rear brake assemblies through the D-port.